The Inflationary Reduction Act is a way for Americans to save money, and one way can be improving to your home. Joining me today is Todd Russo of Rias Air Conditions to give us a little insight on how we can save money uh, when we do improvements to our home. And this is very interesting, Todd, because I'm turning to you for this yeah. and not looking at other things because you guys know what's going on here because it's going to affect your business in a way, but it's also going to affect some of your customers and, and you want them to have this break. Yeah, for sure. So obviously they, the, the Congress just passed the bill last Friday. Uh, it has a number of provisions in there that allows for tax credits and home energy rebates that could be thousands of dollars for homeowners. Some of these packages of rebates are north of fifteen, sixteen thousand dollars $16,000 for a general homeowner. Yeah. So it's, uh, it's an exciting time for us, exciting time for homeowners. Uh, we did this a lot back in 2009 when uh, Obama passed the first stimulus bill. They had included a lot of tax credits there. And Rias uh, was probably the largest contractor in, in the United States in procuring these rebates because we're more than just an air conditioning contractor. We do a lot of home energy auditing, a lot of evaluations of home on a whole house approach. And so our business model was geared towards taking advantage of all these incentives and providing them for our clients. Yeah, and that's where it's important to talk with you because um, even right now, we just had the storms and probably people's air conditioning, uh, electricity, whatever got knocked out. Maybe yep. they take a look at it now and it needs to be redone. Um, and that's something you're saying, okay, let's sit down and talk. Call us out. We'll go through things. But also what's very important here too is that everybody has to realize even though it passed, it's not going to happen the next day. <laughs> yeah, it's going to take a few months for all these programs to get in place. Some of the, some of the plans are retroactive. So we will see things like 2022 tax credits. Uh, so those, for, most, for, some of, for people wanting to take advantage of that, you're gonna wanna do it before year end so you can realize that uh, in your next year's taxes or this year's taxes. Uh, but a lot of the rebate programs will come online next year. Some of them are geared towards more lower and moderate income people. Um, you spoke to the monsoons. It's so funny, I, everybody, oh, monsoons, my, you know, we have air conditioning break because we get a lot, of, a lot of control boards and surges and things like that from the electricity. Well, nobody takes into consideration that when those monsoons come in, it coats your outside unit with dirt and debris and doesn't make the systems run as well. And so, so and that's why you give a call to you, come and clean them and yeah. take care of them, which is important. Um, I would definitely get them cleaned. Okay, I know you have a couple of like uh, bullet points here on okay, the sure. different ways of saying, I know we, we're gonna just talk a little bit about it, but really to get in depth, you wanna give a call to you, Todd. But let's talk a little bit about those different uh, plans yeah. we were talking. Yeah, it's gonna take a one-on-one -on -one evaluation and we can come out for a free appointment and, and kind of go through your options. But there are four new programs. There's a program called the, Ener the Home Energy Performance Program, which is about up to $8,000 in rebates. There's an energy efficiency tax credit, which is 30% off of uh, qualified improvements. Um, there's a, also a program called HOMES, which is up to $14,000 in rebates for homeowners. Uh, that one is triggered towards your income level. So we're gonna have, that's probably gonna be online next year sometime and more, more towards moderate and lower income people. But still a ton of incentives coming out of this bill. Yeah, um, and even to the part where uh, they look at everyone's um, income. Mm -hmm. And you were actually saying people who are, might not be at a, a, a income of what it would say almost 60,000 or something around there they could get uh, some well actually if you make up to close to hundred thousand dollars you'll qualify for that homes program okay. but that's one of four programs so three programs are not uh, contingent on your income only one program is contingent on your income and we don't expect that program to be live until next year yeah and so that's important um, as we are talking about of course the monsoon and getting things cleaned out what's one thing people should be doing right now with the, with the storms uh, but that's giving you guys a call yeah. too but if someone's gonna go up there and try to clean off their or on their yard, what, what should they not do and what should they do? Well, you gotta be careful. So your outdoor unit, um, typically if you got your house maintained and you did a proper maintenance on it in the spring, uh, it would have been clean then. But you know, we get these dust storms come in and it coats those outdoor coils again with that dust and debris. You can clean them. I would caution you to do it yourself because they are electrified with 220 and you can really hurt yourself. Uh, which is why you know we recommend spending a small amount of money having a professional do it. But what happens is there's a heat exchange outside, and the minute you cover that with dust, that heat exchange stops occurring in an efficient manner. Yeah. And so cleaning those is the, the cheapest, easiest way to keep your system running properly. So, Well, I'm going to tear it out. I recommend giving Todd and the team at Rias a call so they can come out and clean. And while they're out there, you talk to them about these amazing uh, rebates and stuff. Yeah, we're also happy to do a, just a free evaluation of what you could and could not qualify for. Perfect. Tell them where they can find more information. Uh, our website is reeis.com, and our phone number is 480-969-7500. Perfect. Todd, thanks for coming in. Brad, thank you. Appreciate it.